A lot of us are constantly on the go, making that drive through both appealing and convenient. In today's Healthy Dose, registered dietitian at Tampa General Hospital, Danielle Sanislo, offers some tips to make smarter choices at your favorite fast food spots while still satisfying those cravings. Let's start in the breakfast line, where a bacon, egg, and cheese sandwich is often on the menu. So a better option would maybe be like an English muffin or a bagel. And that way you're still getting, you know, your calcium, your dairy, from your cheese, and your protein, but we're eliminating some of those saturated fats you might find in maybe like a croissant or a biscuit. Think smarter size options, too. I think kids' meals are, are a great portion control. You get your appropriate serving of your protein with your hamburger or and then you can opt for the apples every once in a while. Instead of depriving yourself, ask for add-ons to sneak in more nutrition. So maybe you add your tomato, your onion, maybe pickles. Make a swap when it comes to sauce options. Any creamy or mayonnaise-based sauces and opt for something a little bit more nutritious. Go for maybe a guacamole or maybe you go for a pico de gallo or a salsa in some sort. And don't get fooled by a salad. Sometimes they're packed with fats and sugar. And then if you add on maybe candied nuts on there, you're adding on sugar um, upwards. And then craisins, a lot of people aren't aware of as well. It's pretty much candied fruit, I like to call it. It's about 23 to 25 grams of added sugar to craisins. Um, but there's nothing wrong with raisins or fresh fruit, strawberries, blueberries, mandarin oranges. Santa's Low says, ask for your dressing on the side so that you can control the amount and then pick healthy fats to pack into your meal. Maybe you add some avocado on there. Maybe you add additional, like, on 10TampaBay.com, Santa's Low talks drink options and making some simple switch-ups that'll save you on calories and sugar.